The overall goal of this procedure is to introduce a versatile electrochemical microfluidic biosensor platform based on low-cost dry film photoresist technology, which is capable of gauging various types of analytes depending on the subsequently used immobilized enzyme-linked assay. This method can help answer key questions in the field of point-of-care testing, such as the quantification of different drugs, like antibiotics, or diagnosing various diseases, such as cancer. The main advantage of this technique is that the herein presented biosensor is mainly based on low-cost materials, easy to use, and highly versatile in terms of its application. Visual demonstration of this method is critical, as the steps related with dry film photoresist are difficult to master, because the handling requires a lot of training and practice. Demonstrating the on-chip assay mobilization and measurement will be Eva Greta, a student assistant from my group. To begin, cut a polyamide or PI substrate into 6-inch round wafers. Then put the PI wafer in an oven at 120 degrees Celsius for roughly 1 hour for a dehydration bake. To perform the first photolithography step for the liftoff process, program the spin coder to a 30-second spinning time at 3000 rpm with an acceleration of 2000 rpm per second. Place the PI wafer on the spin coder and fix it, applying a vacuum. Then start the spin coder program and dispense 2 milliliters of a resist, enabling the liftoff process.